We're joined on the line by uh, Tracy O'Brien and Petra Bangerman uh, from the Boards.ie Photography Group. Uh, ladies, welcome to the show. Thank you. Hi Hello. there. Thanks for joining us. Now, um, we're going to talk about your fundraising photo competition in a moment. You're going to raise money for a charity called Santa Strike Force. But uh, first of all, your, your involvement uh, in this is because you're part of the Boards.ie um, photo group. So just tell us a little bit about that first, uh, maybe, Tracy. Sure, yeah. I suppose Boards.ie is an online forum um, that was set up originally by Tom Murphy and a group of others. But um, we are part of the photography side of the forum and we I suppose, run events, we run photo walks, we meet up. So it's an online community, but there's a, a real life aspect to it as well. And, I suppose the the work we do for Santa Strike Force is part of it was set up by Tom Murphy of Boards.ie, and that's where that links in. So as a yeah. forum, the community I suppose come together. We meet up on photo walks around the country. Um, we go to Charleville Castle every year, and they do their own fundraising. So we kind of we loop in with different projects around the country and do random photo walks then for midweek as well. Yeah, and I, I actually had the pleasure of attending one event. I did a nighttime photo walk to try and get used to my new camera, uh, Sunday Mount Strand, where somebody had steel wool on, on string and they were whiz- light- lighting it on fire and whizzing it around and make, making very very interesting special effects on the camera with the long exposures. I really enjoyed that, and it's very informal, and people should, uh, look, if you're into photography, look that up. It's an informal and sociable group, and, and you, you feed off other people's knowledge. I mean, I was a complete and utter beginner, there was people very kind of uh, serious amateurs, but there's a whole range of people and everyone's very uh, very helpful yeah, in absolutely. that score. Absolutely, and I suppose you, you learn something, but you make some friends as well. You make contacts, there's loads of questions to be asked in photography, and it's great to have people to ask them. Uh, yeah. And one of, the, uh, one of the things that you do to promote your work every year and to, and to raise money for the charity is you produce a beautiful annual photo book, which I've, I saw the one two years ago, a physical copy, that... Uh, Petra had, and then I've seen the online photographs last year. Uh, I was chatting to Tom Murphy uh, last year, I think it was, about, about this. So, your photo book is now being launched tomorrow week, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. On the 30th of November, on the Saturday. Yeah, and uh, Petra, I believe you you have a role in producing that book this year. Well, I did the design, basically. So, we get the photos on from everybody, and this year we have 55 participants. And part of the payment for the book is five euro for the Santa Strike Force. Um, and yeah, then we look through the pictures, put them into the book, put the names and so on to it, and send it to the printer. And now we have the book, and everybody will give, get the book on the 30th then. So I know each person who's submitted a fo- photograph is committed to buying one copy of the book at least, but yeah. do, do you print extra copies for sale for charity? Uh, no, we used to do it, but no, we don't do it anymore. Maybe. Yeah, we've, uh, there is a link available online that goes live once the book is launched. So that link will be on our website, on the boardphotobook.wordpress.com website. So people in the public can buy a copy once the book is launched. OK, and we'll, we'll mention that website again uh, at the end of the interview as well, just to remind people. So so that, that book is being launched. Now, also on the back of that, and on, on Saturday week, tomorrow week, um, you're doing a unique event I suppose it's one of your photo walks but it's also a specific competition tell us a bit about that it sure is yeah we're really excited about it I suppose it brings people out of the the virtual web forum space and out onto the streets and it gets people out of their cameras so we have two categories of a competition it's running in a really short time frame so from one o'clock to two o'clock on Saturday the 30th of November get out with your phone or your camera take a photo and to enter it into the competition there's a five euro charge and that goes directly to the Santa Strike Force uh, pe- so, people get onto this by going online in advance or, or on the day if you, if you don't have to turn up you can do it online in advance you get a code you take your photo you could be in Cork you could take your photograph you then you upload it. You have about a is it a week and a half to upload it? Yeah, it's the Friday the sixth of December is the deadline for submitting your photos. So if you haven't registered in advance, that's okay. The most important thing to do is take a photo between one and two o'clock. You can register afterwards, 
but your photo has to be taken in that hour. Tra- Sorry, Tracy, one quick question. If you, uh, this is a competition, would you have any tips on people of what type of photograph you think we would deem as a, a good quality photo to upload? What kind of photographs that you would, you know, you try not to have um, um, submitted? Well, I suppose everybody is so different and that's where that's what we see as well in the photo book what one person shoots another person would never think of it sure. um and that's where the beauty is in having a bunch of people the, this, these photographs are going to be taken all over the world because this is open one o'clock to two o'clock local time wherever you are but you have to remember prizes can only be posted in ireland so if you're coming home for christmas and you're in sydney Take your photo on Saturday between one and two <laughs> and enter it in. The prize can be posted to your family. You can pick it up when you're home. Okay. I'll just mention that, that website now, actually. It's, it's boardsphotobook.wordpress.com. And yeah. that, that takes people straight to the page with the, the terms and conditions for that competition. Yeah, all of the details are up there. Even if you just Google quick shot event, quick shot competition, the details will come up for you. We're yeah. also on Facebook and Twitter. And, uh, and also, um, for people who do want to, to, to have a physical experience and participate in that photo walk, where are you meeting on Saturday week? The route is just about to be confirmed. So we know that at 1 o'clock we're going to be outside the George's Arcade on Paris Court. The route is going to start just with two hours before that and we're just finalising those details at the moment. But... Um, keep an eye on the website um, check boards.ie forum as well that everything is post- posted up there and we're on Facebook, Twitter so everything will be posted before the date Now uh, whatever money is made is going to go to the Santa Strike Force charity which was also founded by Tom Murphy, I think you mentioned earlier he, he was the founder of boards.ie and he launched his charity quite a few years ago um, I think it started off small with just a, a few gifts to, to one children's hospital and it seems to have uh, expanded massively now. Um, yeah, it, it has exploded. It's absolutely fantastic work that they're doing. I suppose the main thing about this charity is it's a quality of life improvement. So it's for kids that, have, um, that are in an institute, whether it's, um, say, the likes of Bardstown, who have benefited from Santa Strike Force, Laura Lynn, Headstrong, um, Donegal Youth Services. Um, these are just examples of the places that have benefited from the Santa Strike Force. Um, it's where they provide um, a sort of project-related funding, so stuff that the, the charity themselves don't have the funds to, to allow. They, they're focused on more important things and medical things. The Santa Strike Force can come in and provide things for the kids like entertainment systems like ipads like um they they helped with the the bumblance the first ever child focused ambulance and the b for battens guys um were organizing that and santa strike first were in a position to be able to help out with the interior design and the entertainment equipment for that ambulance so it's projects like that that they're that they're able to help with yeah, I was looking at the, there's a summary there on the on the website somewhere. I, I was looking at a link to to uh, Barrett's Town. That's the the children's cancer charity, isn't it? They it they is. benefited to the tune of uh, four thousand euros last year, and they they benefited. They got a Lego room or le- Lego bricks for their Lego room, um, and they got a, a a lot of MP3 players for all the individual houses there, where they only had one between them. Now they've got thirteen or fourteen MP3 players. Now you know. That's that's the kind of stuff, isn't it? That's what you're getting at. Yeah, it's the kind of stuff the charity can't afford to spend money on themselves. So it's great to have that, you know, that presence and, you know, somebody who who can help out. You can do those kind of things. And I suppose it's, um, you know, it's, it's it's for kids. It's for the kids that are in those services and, you know, who need those services. But it's also for their siblings. It's also for their brothers and sisters and friends that are coming in to visit them. So it makes everybody's experience that little bit better. Yeah, sure. So, just one last question, Tracy. Sorry, before we wrap up the interview, if somebody wants to contribute to the charity Santa Strike charity coming up to Christmas, um, is quite soon. Um, how can they go about donating if they're not like, taking part in this photo comp? Yeah, we have a website for the Santa Strike Force. It's linked to from our own um, our own website, and there is a PayPal account there that you can donate directly to the Santa Strike Force. Okay, so so the so the the critical place to look at is really your website, which is I'll say it again, it's boardsphotobook 
www.wordpress.com. Exactly. Yeah. And the event. Just Google us and it'll come up for you. Yeah, and that event is tomorrow week in the Market Arcade, um, the opposite end to George Street entrance. You'll be meeting there probably before one o'clock, I'd say, around yeah. about one. Uh, and people can register for that competition there and then, can't they? You can, yeah. We will have registration forms on the spot. You can register afterwards. Most important thing is take your photos between 1 and 2 o'clock. We're going to be checking the times on them. This is a quick shot. Yeah, so you need to get your camera set up so the time is correct. Mm -hmm. Exactly. That's a big thing. Check the date and the time in your camera. Um, Even just get out there with your phone. You know, it's it's about having fun. We're going to do a, a documentary, I suppose, of what's going on in that hour all across the world. Um, primarily Ireland but it's going to be great um, and you'll see all of the results are going to be posted on pics.ie and the judges are going to be choosing the winners by um, the following week so all of those prizes we've got fantastic sponsors O2, 3, Rico, 360 DPI and Data Solutions so fantastic prizes um, and you know you'll see you'll get to see all of the results they're going to be up in the public eye Okay, I know um, uh, yourself and Petra have been chatting to us, but the, you're part of a team, aren't you? You're just uh, the, the, oh, the, yeah. the, 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 front, the front of house, if you like. But it, there's a lot of volunteers yeah. involved in getting this together, isn't there? Yeah, there's a whole forum behind us. So um, we've had lots of support, and I think that's what it is. Like the, the photo book alone is nothing without those 50 photographers, 50 odd. So, I mean, that's fantastic for people to donate an image and to get involved and to buy a book. That's what it's all about. It's a community effort. So thank you. We, we, we wish you the best of luck with your photo comp tomorrow and with the charity and everything that goes. And thanks Lovely. for taking the time to talk to us this morning, myself and Martin Cook. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks very much. Uh, so that's uh, Tracy O'Brien and Petra Bangiman of uh, the Boards.ie photo group. And that website, one more time, is boardsphotobook.wordpress.com for that competition taking place uh, Saturday weeks. Uh, Saturday weeks.